Hello, Ben and Bethany here with another book for you. This one is called Zero by Catherine Otoshi. She actually lives here in the Bay Area, and this book is extra special to us because she signed it for Ben. It says, Ben, you count. She signed it. So it's uh, one we really enjoy. Hope you will enjoy it too. Zero was a big round number. When she looked at herself, she saw a hole right in her center. Every day she watched the numbers line up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. She wanted to count two. But how could a number worth nothing become something? Zero felt empty inside. She watched one having fun with the others. One was a solid and strong with bold strikes and square corners. Zero was big and round with no corners at all. If I were like one, then I could count two, she thought. So she pushed and she pulled and she stretched and then she straightened. She forced and flattened and finally became... She sighed. Becoming like one was too much of a stretch. Eight and nine rolled onto the scene. If you doubled yourself up, you'd be like me, said eight. So zero twisted and turned to try to be eight. Or you could be a nine with a longer line, said nine. So Zero pinched and puckered to try to be like nine. But Zero could only be Zero. We're on our way to join the others. Come count with us, they said. Zero felt deflated. Eight and nine were numbers with value. Of course they'd count. How could they know how she felt? Zero had a new thought. She could impress the numbers that that'd give her value. She'd leap, she'd soar, she'd sizzle and shine. She'd make a grand entrance and floor them all. Zero, Zero began to roll faster and faster. And faster, she leaped, flying, soaring, rocketing. Right into one. Who knocked over two. Who fell into three and four. Toppling five and six. Who crashed into seven and eight. Where they all ended up in a big pile on nine. The numbers were bent out of shape. It's no use trying, sobbed Zero. I'll never have value. I'll never be part of the count, she said. It's what's inside that counts most, pointed out Seven. Zero looked at herself. But what if I don't have anything inside? Every number has value, said Seven. Be open. You'll find a way. Suddenly, Zero saw herself in a new light. I'm not empty inside. I'm open. Zero rolled up to the numbers. I've thought of a way for us to count even more, she said. Count, I thought, oh, count more, asked four. Count us in, exclaimed seven. Lead the way, said one. Everyone counts, the numbers shouted. Zero jumped in. Then she leaped up high and said, Here's something new we can try. If we help each other soar, we can count even more. Let's count again, starting with... 10! 20! 30! 40! 50! 60! 70! 80! 90! And what's next? A hundred! A thousand! Ten thousand! Hundred thousand! One million! We do count more, they cheered. Zero and the numbers explored and had fun, bringing more value to everyone. And this time, when she looked at herself, she felt whole. Right in her center. 
Right. Hope you enjoyed that. And what a great reminder that indeed we all count. Have a good night. Good night.